Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. How? Who? Their leader. Joseph Seed. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. Hey, rookie. Rookie. You're wasting your time. There's no signal out here. Crossing over the hand bane now. How much longer? Uh, just long enough for you to change your mind. So we can turn this bird around. You want me to ignore a federal warrant, Sheriff? No, sir. I want you to understand the reality of this situation. Joseph Seed, he's not a man to be fucked with. We've had run-ins with him before. They haven't always gone our way. Just sometimes. Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. Yeah, well, we have laws for a reason, Sheriff. And Joseph Seed's gonna learn that. Pratt, open a call with dispatch. 10-4. White Horse to dispatch, over. Right We're approaching the compound, Nancy. Over. Roger, Sheriff. You still plan to go through with this? Over. We are. Unfortunately, still trying to talk some sense in our friend, the Marshal. Over. All right. Lucky I'm not there. Get into any trouble, you just let me know. Over. Therefore, over and on. Maybe we should have brought Nancy along with us instead of the probie. These Peggy's wouldn't fuck with her. Pratt. Why do you keep calling them Peggy's? Project at Eden's Gate. P.E.G. Peggy's is what the locals call them. You know, they started off harmless enough a few years back, but now they are armed to the teeth. You know, they're looking for a fight. Are you scared, Sheriff? We're here. Compound's just below. <sighs> oh, my Jesus. This is a bad idea. Last chance, Marshal. <sighs> We're going in. Roger that. Dispatch, you still there? Yes, go ahead, Sheriff. You don't hear from us in 15 minutes. Send in everyone. Call the goddamn National Guard if you have to. Over. Yes, sir, Sheriff. I'll be praying for you. Now listen up. Three rules. Stick close. Keep your guns in your holsters. And let me do the talking. Got it? Got it. Rookie! All right, everyone. Stay sharp. Let's go! You'll be in the 
the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rooks, I mean. Stay with us, huh? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Everything's fine, that's it. It's just fine. Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, the Zeta will respect the badges from here. They'll respect a 9mm. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet, Marshal. Good. Take it easy. No one gets hurt. Respect a nine millimeter. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet, Marshal. Start the project because we know what happens next. They will come, they will try to take from us, take our guns, take our freedom, take our faith. We will not let them, Sheriff. Come on, hold on. Marshall. We will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff, sure. there will be no more right. suffering. No, fuck it. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. Do not touch that service Hold on and don't stand down. Stand down. Everyone calm down. We knew this moment would come. And we've prepared for it. 
Go. Go. God will not let them take me. I saw when the Lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. Behold, it was a white horse. And hell followed with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. Rook, put the cuffs on him. Put down your guns, take your friends, and walk away. Come on, rookie. God is watching us, and he will judge you on what you choose in this moment. God damn it, rookie! Sheriff? Hold on, Marshal. Sometimes it's best to leave well enough alone. We're leaving, Rook. What the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Sheriff, get back there. Shut up and listen. You put those cuffs on him. None of us get out of here alive. I will have you all arrested. So be it. <laughs> 